In this video, we are going to solve a problem about finding the probability of a uniform distribution. Let's take a look at this example. The waiting times between a subway departure schedule and the arrival of a passenger are uniformly distributed between 0 and 6 minutes. Find the probability of a randomly selected passenger has a waiting time greater than 2.25 minutes. So we know that the y-axis represent for p of x or the probability of um, x and the x variables here represent the number of minutes. Now, because this problem states that this is a uniformly distributed um, curve, therefore if you draw the curve, it should be a flat curve because it, it is uniform. So we have only one value for the entire variables x because this is a uniform for the entire region. All right. So we are looking for the interval between 0 and 6 minutes. So this is 0 and the max is 6 minutes. Okay. And remember, the summation of or the probability should be 1 or the area under the curve is 1 so all the area has to be equal to 1 now we know that the area is equal to 1 so that help you to find this value right here so how do I find this value right here well we know that this is the area of the rectangle and the area of the rectangle let's just call this value uh, y now the area of the rectangle is equal to the length times the width so we have the length here l times the width and the length of that should be 6 units and then the width here is the y value and then the whole area is need to be equal to 1 Therefore, you can solve for y divide both sides by 6 or 1 over 6. So the, the value here should be 1 over 6. And now the question is finding the probability that a randomly selected passenger has a waiting time bigger than 2.25 minutes. So let's call this point is 2.25. So we are looking for all the value that, is, that are big, bigger than 2.25 or we are looking for this area under the curve from 2.25 up to 6. So now you are looking for this area right here. Okay, And that's pretty simple to find that area of this uh, this. Uh, interval again we take the length times the width because this is a rectangle now the length is this this distance right here and to find this distance right here we take 6 we subtract this value 2.25 that is the distance of the ring portion right here and then times the width, width of that that is 1 6 and if you do the calculation correctly, 6 times 6 minus 2.25 and then multiply by 1 over 6, you should get 0 0.625. And therefore, the probability that a randomly selected passenger has a waiting time bigger than 2.25 minutes is 0 0.625 or converting that to percentage, that should be 62.5%.